So this is Moss number seven. It's on 116th and Lenox Avenue. You can't miss it. You can't miss it. And, uh, and right below it is the barber shop. Let me tell you guys. This is the I'm not sure if it's still owned. Uh, it's still in the family, but a lot of Nation of Islam members used to get their hair cut there. That's where uh, Muhammad Ali, Joe Lewis, Sugar Ray Robinson, Malcolm X, that's where they all got their hair cut right there. Your modern barber salon. I'm unsure if it's still owned by, by the original father. Uh, I, I've met them a few years. I met the son a few years back. Right above it, you can see the entrance where it says Malcolm Shabazz. Now, why this is, this was mosque number seven from the Nation of Islam, but when W.D. Muhammad took it over, he took the chairs out and named it, uh, he renamed it, he, he renamed mosque number seven. So, so that's the story behind it. And 116th and Lenox Avenue, every story, many of his interviews happened literally right here when he walked out, all the press was waiting on him when you guys see that stuff. Many of the interviews you see online, if he's outside, more often than not happen literally right here on 116th Street. And, and this is what I mean when they went, when they marched, they marched down 116th Street, made a right on St. Nick, and went to the police station. So it's not too far. You know, all these landmarks I'm giving you, walking distance, man. You can do this in a day. So have fun on your next trip to Harlem. And uh, my next trip, I'll do like Joe Lewis and uh, uh, Jackie Robinson. Jackie Robinson, I believe Jackie Robinson lived, lived, lived here. And uh, he got some landmarks. And uh, Joe Lewis actually owned a block here. Uh, I'll take you guys by that on my next trip. I just don't have time to do it today. But uh, it's named after Sister Claire Muhammad and Malcolm X, as you guys can see on the title. And, and he did that, in, in my opinion, uh, Wallace did this because he despised, he ultimately despised his dad. And uh, uh, he did that in revenge of his dad and to pay tribute and homage to Malcolm X and his mother, Claire Muhammad. So do your research, do your homework. I've spent countless hours researching this stuff. And there you have, it. so that's the Cliff Notes version. And that's the door right there where Malcolm X came out often. And this is the dome. You know, the most famous. This is probably one of the more famous buildings in Harlem. So, as it as it pertains, him and this and the Adam Clayton Powell building, the Teresa Hotel, and all that good stuff. Maybe I'll go by the Teresa Hotel later too, and uh, give you guys a tour of that. So anyway, I'll talk to you guys. Soon.